one, we are focusing our attention on political liberation. A few weeks ago, when Pastor Moses shared with us the reason why it's important to talk about politics in the church, we shared that politics comes from the Greek word politikos, which means shared life of citizens or the arrangement of human life together. We shared about the need to reclaim this word because it's good and sacred. And we as a church, we need to talk about it. We also shared that Jesus lived a political life, a symbol of liberation for those who are sick, shunned by society, those who are most vulnerable and powerless. We as a church, we need to reclaim When I was in my 20s, um, I struggled in a lot of ways, as I guess most 20 year olds would struggle. Um, and I, I shared some of my struggles with you before, but I, in my early 20s, I moved from my home here in Hawaii to Los Angeles. Um, and so I moved on my own, and in the midst of all of that, I was dealing with my sexuality, and uh, in some ways, I was kind of starting over. I felt lost and alone. And if you combine those feelings with being an extreme introvert, which, which I am, the result is isolation. I began to believe in this narrative that I didn't need anyone. And I was content with just being by myself. As long as I have my music, I should be fine. Clearly, it's not true. Jesus defines the relationship between himself and his disciples through the analogy. 